So in my last video, we saw the Arlarlo AMX-12 do a 2S and 3S speed run and not bad runs on either of those. 89, we got 89 kilometers per hour. I wanna pass that 100 kilometer mark and this could be pure stupidity. I don't know if the 45 amp ESC is gonna handle it. I'm not recommending anybody does this. Sometimes I do dumb things and this could be one of them because I'm gonna run it on 4S. I picked up this gold bat. 4S LiPo, and I'm gonna do a speed run just to see. I'm not gonna run it long on 4S. I don't wanna burn it up. This could be an awesome experience, or it could just be a total fail, and I burn the Arl Arlo to the ground. Hopefully the ESC can handle it. I haven't seen any videos where people ran 4S LiPos on the stock ESC, but before we do these speed runs, I did notice after cleaning this up, and looking it over, I didn't have anything break, which is pretty amazing because I did bash it pretty hard. But I did have a tweak in there, the hinge pin on the rear. And I think it's when I did my 3S speed run and it cartwheeled down the road. I think that's probably what bend it. I just never noticed it. So the first thing we're gonna do is we are gonna replace that hinge pin. And then after that, we're gonna switch over from the 17 tooth pinion to the 27 tooth pinion so we can get a higher top speed out of this car. So I'm actually a little nervous plugging this in right now. I don't know what's gonna happen. I think the ESC probably will handle the voltage. I just don't want the motor to get too hot. So when I do my speed runs, I'm just gonna give it light throttle and just ease into it. So let's get let that get set up. Have the GPS on here. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna plug it in. We'll see what happens. So the number one goal is do not catch on fire. Number two goal, is to hit that 100 kilometer per hour mark. Let's start, here we go. Again, I don't know what to expect. I also don't recommend doing this. Again, I'm dumb and I'm just doing this for experimental purposes. Well, here we go. Oh, is it smoking? Is it? Just kidding, I don't see it smoking. Whoa, 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 that's fast. Oh, and I got a big tractor coming here. <laughs> Let's see what we got on that pass. The highest I got before was 89 kilometers per hour. That was 78. I'll let this tractor pass here. How are we doing for temperatures? It doesn't feel too hot. I think we're all right. Let's try it again. Uh-oh. wanted to lift off. All right, let's bring it back here. Let's see what we get. Ninety-four. I'm gonna go for it. Whoa. Let's see what we got. I felt faster. I felt faster. Let's read it. Ninety-five. So it was faster. Oh, I'm so close. I don't want to stop, but I don't want to burn this thing up. Let's check, see if we're smoking, anything's real hot. The motor doesn't seem too hot either, so I think we're good. So close, I don't want to stop. I kind of want to keep going now, since it seems like the electronics can handle the, the four cell. <laughs> 94. Oh man, 99, one more, I need one more. I got it, I got the 100. 
I got the hundred. I know I do. Whoa! Almost hit a pedestrian here. <laughs> Let's try it out. Let's see what we got. Oh, I got 99 again. Okay, so I had to shut it off. It did seem like it was getting warm. Those last few runs definitely heated up the motor a little bit. I have to beat 99. I just have to. So we'll turn it back on. Here we go. This is gonna do it. I don't know if that did it. Let's run it up. Let's run it up. Oh, there we go. I think I did it. I think I did it. Let's bring it back. All right, I'm pretty sure I did it on that last run. Did we beat 100? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we got 104 on that one. Can it run 4S? Yes, it can run 4S. Do I recommend doing it? Absolutely not. But we did cross the 100 kilometer per hour mark. So yes, new personal best. So that'll be it for this video. So thanks for checking it out, watching me do these speed runs and, and beating that 100 kilometer per hour mark. So if you didn't already, click the subscribe button down below.